Hey, 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 family, it's your girl Evelyn here, and I am back with another video. So, here's the thing. I have been sharing some beauty videos with you guys. Now, here's the thing. As I'm filming this, I have not put the video, the, the beauty videos up yet. By the time I get to this video, I will have put the video, videos up. And so I kind of want to get a feel from you if you are enjoying the beauty content or if you miss my talking head videos because I'm thinking about starting a podcast. Well, I'm, I'm like 75% sure that I want to start a podcast. I had a podcast before, but it was for my food brand. And um, I really enjoyed that format. I, I felt like it was a lot easier for me to be consistent because I didn't have to put on a face <laughs> to do it. Not that I don't like putting on makeup. Y'all, listen, I love it. Listen to me, I have on today the Viseart Libertine palette. And I also have on the Viseart dark edit pattern together very very similar color schemes but wanted to do something different um so there's no brown in my eye there's like a little bit of like a terracotta there's some purple some blue this kind of deep teal color anyway i'm thinking about starting a podcast because there's some things i want to talk about when it comes to black women in luxury when it comes to femininity not trying to be a femininity coach or expert, but more so kind of like your sister in the femininity journey as I grow and evolve and um, continue to learn from some of my favorite people, which I typically will link um, to my favorite femininity books that have really helped me in my journey below. So those will be in the description box as well, probably in most of my videos at this point. Um, but. I also kind of want to talk about like self-care and I feel like I know for me sometimes yes I want to sit down and watch a video but a lot of times I would like to listen to what that person is saying I want to be able to do it in the car I want to be able to do it when I'm waiting at a doctor's office I want to be able to do it when I'm washing dishes things like that and I have found that while I could still do that with a YouTube video I have really enjoyed the podcast format. So, or I listen to a lot of things like a podcast, right? Like while I'm doing my makeup, things like that. So uh, let me know uh, if that's something you're interested in. Even if you're not, I, I'm like, I'm, I'm asking cause I, I do want to gauge with you because this is kind of where my stuff has lived. But I really, I really miss YouTube. Can I, can I just, can I, let me just digress for a second. I miss YouTube as a hobby that when I first started my YouTube channel, you could not monetize and you could not like really make money at all. I remember when the partnership program was introduced. I remember when you had to be invited to the partnership program, not apply. You had to be invited. And I remember it was like a big deal when I got invited to the partnership program. I remember when YouTube were was inviting creators to private events to help them grow their channel and all that kind of stuff. And it was this really, really fun hobby for me. And while my theme or my focus back then was natural hair, you know, I do miss doing beauty content. Um, I think that I went through a season where I was like, okay, there's only so much I'm going to do with my hair. Like, and I didn't want to talk about that anymore necessarily, or I didn't want that to be my sole focus. But I'm in a place where there's so many things that I want to share and talk about and I want to be able to do it consistently and in a way that's fun and easy. So I want to put my beauty content on the channel, obviously, so you can see it. But I kind of want to put my more like talking content, things like that in a podcast. And I may still put the podcast on the channel, but it may not, you may not see my face. Like, would you be okay with like an audio video? Meaning like, there's just a picture of me being like, okay. <laughs> and then you hear that so that, you know, you can comment, you know, we can dialogue in the comment section, but I really want to do that. I really want to, um, also create ways and experiences for 
me to dive deeper in some of the things that I want to talk about, some of the things that Patricia and I have talked about on our live streams that we did in 2020, just things that have come up in the comment section, messages that I have received, you know, just womanhood in general stuff that I feel like, you know, either our foremother, foremothers didn't know or didn't have the space or the time or the energy to be able to really pour into us or things that just I have found useful to me on my journey. You know, I'm in my 40s now. And so, you know, I feel like I've learned a little bit. I can't say that I know everything. I, I, can't, I, I do not, I don't even pretend that I know everything or close to anything, but I do feel like that the woman that I was 10 years ago, 15 years ago, even five years ago, I'm such a different woman now. And if I can share that to somebody who's six months behind me, not just in age, but maybe in a certain area. And then also dialogue with those of you who are ahead of me, whether it's in age or in experience, right? I, I, I really want it to be more like a, a family, a sisterhood, a community. So I wanted to come on and um just say that like just I, I don't know if you would call it a channel update maybe it is a channel update um but that yeah i asked a lot of questions so basically would you be open to a podcast would you engage with that are you enjoying the beauty content um here's the thing i you know can i just be honest like i want to know but I'm, I'm probably gonna do it anyway <laughs> but i still want to know your feedback right because that's just where i'm leaning but also I'm open to suggestions. Maybe there is um, some things that I haven't considered. And then maybe there's things for me that you want to see that you haven't seen. So also let me know about that. Like, are there things that you would like me to talk about? Are there subjects or are there particular questions that you would like for me to respond to? Are there beauty things that you would like me to do and see and things like that? So. Um, I, 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 I'm not going to turn into an, a haul exclusively channel because I know I've had a couple of different hauls here because like I'm not trying to spend money like that. Uh, but I do want to share as things come along because as I have dipped my toe into luxury beauty, I have found that women of my hue, there are black women doing great luxury beauty channels, um, kinky sweat. There's a uh, Glam Girl Chelsea, there's Kelsey Brianna J, there's Vicky J, um, there's there's several black women in the luxury beauty space, which just happens to be an, in an interest of mine right now. But I need somebody like that's deep like me to to see things on, try things out, you know, different looks, things like that. So they have been an amazing resource for keeping me up to date and introducing me to brands and products and things that I have never seen before. So I really, really enjoy their channels. I will leave their channels below. Um, the ladies that I mentioned. But yeah, okay, so this was a rambling video. I haven't done one of these in a long time, but um Talk back to me, let me know, and then just let me know how have you been doing. I just want to know how you've been doing. Like, I can't believe that we're this far into 2021 and in a matter of a few months, 2020 will have been two years ago. So with that being said, I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.